guys um welcome to britech mechatronic today um what we have here is mercedes benz um ecu this is def ecu as you can see it's written over here def U. this is ng651 crd 3 plus or CRD, um, crd1 or 11 and what we have here is hashtag I'm using hashtag this time around I'm not using flex I'm using hashtag um, so as you can see it is the diagram I've opened the diagram already but I need to close it and show you something from here so as you can see from these sessions these are the um, defi sessions we have with um, hashtag so any of this one crd3 cr3.1.7 crd3.f1 e1 all these types um any of them supposed to or has to read um the distance um up to this session has to read the cdi this is supposed to read this one the diagram and everything are the same so we click on CRD 3 um, then we click on bench then we click on next it is either we, we will do by OBD or boot mode or bench and we are going to do it by bench boot mode we need to open the board that's the meaning of the differences boot mode as you can see over here or tricore mode you need to open the board so that some wires or pins on the board and we all know obd obd simply means we have to prop the obd socket onto the card and you read the data from the car in our situation i'm not going to do it by obd i'm going to do it by bench but i've click on the obd for us to see whether we can get a full distance um this is it this is the obd session then we click back we click on, on it again then we click on bench mode bench mode we are not going to open the ecu but what we do is that we connect our wire harness or cables onto it then here you come to this session then we click on wire wiring then we click on wiring window will pop up for you to see the diagram and this is the diagram as you can see over here and this is the connection method it, either you use this is this one that you're going to use or this is the same so this are this is our connection or diagram hold it so um i'm going to connect our piece this is the old ecu and this is the new ecu Our pin 5 is power, which is red. Pin 2 is 8, which is black. Um, So the wire harness has been connected successful over here what you left is that we connect our box with a uh, hashtag pro or hashtag pro um, power mode model we connect it to the hashtag unit our power is already connected the power is already connected everything is connected and this thing works on online so in order for us to know whether we have a good communication with the ECU, we click on EEPROM, internal EEPROM, then we click on read to see. 
if you have a good communication it's supposed to start to connect with the ECU you, you, you have everything over here so see, it was connected successful so we had a good read um, this we are going to do a full backup so we click on full backup meanwhile uh, my I'm coming I need to create um, a folder for it um, when you start communicate with the ECU then I'll go to the distant uh, dashboard to create a folder as you can see it's reading the flash internal flash and it has three sectors which is internal flash internal EEPROM and external EEPROM so I need to I need to create a folder CRD 3.1 So our reading is in progress This is it What was that? It was a noise so Uh, I need to show you something as you can see um, um, this is the new one it's right the CRD 3.1 R UM651 afterwards I will turn this one and show you something you have it CRD 3.1 plus so I don't know I need to show you so um, um i wanted to pause somewhere so that after the distance i don't want the video to be long oh you let's wait for the session to finish reading then Done over here. Um, um, desktop CRD 3.1. I made it old. So afterwards, um, this one there is no need to take the power off we will disconnect our power model then we take our plug, our pins out so i'm going to connect to this one It is a full guy here, so we click on read on this one and see whether we have a good communication with it again with a new one. Yeah, yes, we have a good communication. There is no need for me to save it, so we click on. Um, I have to back up because I don't know what will happen, so I'm backing up the data and I'll save it. So uh, the backup is in progress. So I'll pause here and start from the 
session whereby I'll be writing the testing later. It is done over here, so It will take a long time to write, so I need to pause somewhere then continue from that session. So we are <clears throat> at ninety something with the writing of the flash. So we get it done. Um, we are done. A book, get nice. So we are done. Who did this thing? 